walls are crawling. God. But if you're here, where the hell is everyone else? Don't tell me. They're all right. But it's a long story. You lot don't do things by halves, do you? Well, at least everyone's still breathing. Now, as for these writings, I'm sorry to say, Clive, but if you had those, you'd be... Sitting under a pile of rubble, I know. But we were able to save a few bits and pieces from the ruins, most of which ended up being used to build this place. The more personal items we gave to the next of kin. In the case of Sid's things, that would have been mid. Then I'll check the workshop. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to part 35. You already know what time it is, bro. Is that, is that time? Is that part of the game, bro? You know, we take a slow, slow burn type shit. We're just taking it slow. This looks like a strip since old diary. Uh, and you'll already have read it. I'd better keep looking. What's over here? Good to oh, okay. I remember seeing this doll in Sid's cellar. I wonder if it was Mids. Mirado, I know you like your riddles, so I reckon you'll appreciate this one. Of all my inventions, this one's the best. And so, in choosing its place of rest, I recalled your opus, Daughter Dearest, and now it sleeps there in the first. I'm going to have to work on that last rhyme. Good luck, Sid. I'll be Sid, man. I probably got it this early. I thought we'd get a little bit more crazy stuff and come back to this. You wouldn't happen to know what Mid's first opus was. Opus? That girl's as tone deaf as a banshee. Unless you mean the orchestra. She couldn't have been more than what, 11, 12, when she cobbled that thing together? It surprised us all. Not least her dad. You should have seen how proud he was of the little scamp. What's that battered old box had to do with anything? I think Sid may have hidden something inside it. Hmm. You surprise me. Those two and their bloody treasure hunts. Half the things in the hideaway were hidden one time or another. This something caught on one of the gears. Did you break it? Can you fix it? No, I mean, yeah, yes. There. How about now? You fixed it! Sid fixed it! He more than fixed it! Yeah! New music! Huh. Never heard this one before. They started playing when I removed this. Whatever it is. Don't look at me. I can tell you it's important, though. Sid showed it to me once and said as much. Said it was the stuff dreams were made of. <sighs> Let's just hope it's the stuff ships are made of as well. Indeed. Let's see if we can make some dreams come true. So we all set. We're gonna play this game until we finish with it. Now, 
after this, we'll probably catch up on the experience. Because by the time we finish this, episodes two and three of the experience will be out. So, we'll work on those. And by the time we get done all that, I think it's about time for um, September again to drop. Then again, some of these games I might not even play on the channel for real. It might just be like, you know, personal time type of, you know. You feel me? So, we might still got room for some more games. But I gotta go back and finish RE4 remaking this with me. Right, my dad had it all worked out. He'd be proud of you, Mid. His writings may have helped, but this achievement is all yours. <laughs> Can we catch them? The INA is one of the largest, fastest vessels ever built. And it won't help she has the wind at her back. Any other ship would be hard pressed to keep pace with her, let alone reel her in. But this isn't any other ship. This is the Enterprise! Oh, shit, my job. And the world's never seen anything like my dad's engine. It certainly hasn't. Player, what do you know of Barnabas Tharn? Only what the bards sing. But he sailed to ash from southern lands. But it was his mastery of the blade which won him the throne. And that his sword, Odin's sword, can sever the very threads of creation. But don't lose any sleep over a last tilt. We'll do what we must to survive. We must. The light! I thought this cool was meant to be hidden! Fuck. Mid. Company! Hey? We'll hold them off until the ship is ready. But hurry! Bollocks! All lands! Man your stations! <laughs> oh, so we got the whole squad. I think this we squatted up. Oh, yeah. I like this. We are a fucking unit. The fact that Gav is alive for this long is kind of crazy. I ain't my lot, so I kind of expect him to be dead by a few videos ago. But it's all good, though. Still rock what you have. Here they come. Fuck your shit then. I'm going to set everybody ablaze. Look how OP that shit is. How are we doing, mid? I thought you said that ship was. Come on, where they at? Jump his ass. There you go. Yeah. Where's the big boys at? You know the big boys is coming. And there he is. I guess I guess I can't lock on. We'll be right with you in a second, big boy. Nope. Some of your powers, bro. Oh my god. Oh yeah. 
Ow. Ouch. Come on, that's one. Turn me up. Come on, got to. Have y'all don't stun on man? That's three. Yup, you fucked up now, buddy. Come here, you. Oh yeah, you see that damage? Why is he here? Oh, what? But I thought he was... Did we not kill him? Confounded. Then it is as I feared. Sleipnir is no man, but the creation of Odin. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Nah. I can stop dropping from the sky now. Y'all can stop jumping from the sky now. Have you no normal enemies? Have you seen this world, my guy? Don't tell me they all gonna fight like this, dude. I should have always said they're gonna be buff. Right, Not buff, but you know, nerfed. Boy, there was a time people called me the executioner. Who was my ex? No matter, heads will roll all the same. Mate, new plan. You leave. We follow. Follow? Swimming, are you? Yes, we are. Get it, Ryan. You know how, you know how I am. These foes will not fall. Come on. Yes, they will. Good thing I brought one. That's two, that's three. That's four. Let him have it. Just keep on killing them then. Oh yeah. Oh that is they got is tagging their ass. Oh my god. Damn damn damn. Now you're like damn near all of them unless they keep spawning in. And they just chopping in anything. Anybody else? I guess so. In your own time, Clive. All right, we coming. Yeah, watch out. Ooh. That is insane. 
the hell did he make that jump? That is crazy. Oh, I got six down, seven thousand. I'm about to go buy some shit. What do you want? That's quite a mess you've made. And wholly unnecessary. <sighs> you are my offering to Muthos. I would not see you damaged. I don't suppose Mid has a spare engine. <laughs> Since you rose from the grave, my fortunes have plummeted. Are you absolutely certain of this quest of yours, Clive? The foes you face are as terrible as they are numerous. Aye, and they'd have us live and die on their terms, which should answer your question. Ah. You have that same stubborn look as your father did when he set his mind to something. On the battlefield, I am but a single axe. A deadly one, mind, but a single one nonetheless. Yet what you require is a thousand, and I believe my old friend in Brandalar can provide them. Take care, Clive. I have many more tales of your father's exploits to share. And I cannot very well do that if you're dead. Again. Good luck, Uncle. And may fair winds attend you. As for you, Joshua, take care. I shall do my best, Uncle. Farewell, my nephews. When next you see me, it shall be with an army at my back. Cheerio! <laughs> 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 <sighs> Keep up, my boy. Well, we can't have him showing us up now, can we? We would never hear the end of it.
Titan. My lord. I must have missed something because I ain't finished in a while. I'm like, how the fuck he alive? I must have missed something I forgot. How the fuck is that guy alive? There's a lot of sea between here and Walud, but any ship heading north has to round Zemeckis and put through the narrow. Maintain our current bearing north northeast, and we'll catch the Black Galleon before she vanishes again. What's to prevent her from circling around Ash from the south? With these winds in those waters, it'd take him forever and a fortnight to reach Stone here. Mid knows what she's talking about, Clive. Better than any of us lot, anyway. I say we do as she tells. Sails on the horizon. She's ours. This girl can do. Where one leads, so does the other follow. The bond of consciousness which joins them condemning both to the same fate. Yet my every attempt to strike it from their hearts serves only to tighten its hold. Hey, bro, chill out, bro. Now, what are you getting from doing this? Oh, my God. Are oh, you ready for it? Are you ready for it? You look ready for it. How did they make it in time? I'm about to fight this nigga right now type shit. If I find him on the water, it'd be kind of crazy. Crazy self going on that boat with that nigga, man. Do the mail storm. Strong, my man. My man. Where did you hide her, Barnabas? Come on. Okay, 
catch his breath. He must do no damage. Oh, God. Oh, am I, am I being dosed? Am I, can I kill him? Can I kill him? I can. Nice. Protection. Okay, protection. Come on. Oh, hello. Nope. Oh, brother, sit your ass down, bitch. What is it? That shit ain't working, buddy. Oh, I guess it is. Nope. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna do that. See what I want to do for real, but fuck it. What's up, bitch? And you shot it. That's two, and you shot it. Your niggas and it shouldn't even happen. Let it go. Just take care of everybody. I guess. I yo. Yeah, 
Uh, back up, back, get off of it. Back up. Nope, come on. Two. That's three. I thought like we could just fucking lose just a three on him. On top of that, hit with that flame. Shit on him. There it is. Bitch. She must be here somewhere. Okay, bet. Do we not just come up that way? Maybe is this what we came up? Hold on, I'm gonna click this shit real quick. Can never leave no loot behind. I don't care if I need it or not. Can never leave it behind. Nah, I think I already won that one. Come for you anyways. Oh. Come on. Many of us. And only one. Fuck out of here. Alright, we just came this way. Here we go. Jill. You came. Yeah, dude. Boy, Falcon up, boy, what you doing? There we go. He about to get fucking bodied, huh? He ate that shit, bro. Ah, oh, that is ridiculous. Oh, 
Oh, shit. But to where? You. What did you do to Joshua? Phoenix? Oh, I expect he will survive. This consciousness in which you coil your feeble souls is grown thick with desperation. And thus has my master turned to my blade. The world will soon be painted in black. And all that live shall gather in death's autumn wake. Not if we remove the cause of this misery. Not if we destroy the last of the Mother Crystals and restore balance to the world. Come. Do you truly think it's so simple? The Blight is inevitable. Not even the Almighty might stop its endless march. Your efforts will avail us naught. Naught, that is, but suffering. You must embrace the truth, Mythos. Accept your place with the Lord. Keep it. As long as there's a chance, there's a choice. Ever led astray by your blind resolve. Now, it is time you learn the inevitability of your divine fate. However much it may hurt. Get as far away as you can. Clive, no. Trust me, Jill. <sighs> Shit, are we really about to do this? Wait, wait. How much time do I got? Forty-five. Oh, this is gonna be another hour-long video. Fuck it. We don't have to do this. Oh, but we do. No, we don't. Come on, none of that shit, bro. I'm here. Oh, we got that Melania shit. Hold on, bitch. In the short time since our last meeting, you have grown much. Yet as a vessel, I fear my lord will still find you lacking. <laughs> Come on, 
Come on. Oh shit. Don't dodge it, bitch. Take all that shit. Oh, what the fuck? What in the anime? Crazy. That is crazy. That is ridiculous. Bro, no, there's no way they expect me to. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. It's Jover. It's fucking Jover. How do I? Oh, boy. Oh, he's about to fuck me. Oh, he just fucked me. Come on, we still up, though. Okay, not supposed to happen. Never. Not supposed to happen. Okay. Right? Okay, that's supposed to happen. Okay, okay. I about to say, but how the fuck they expect me to stop that shit? Do you not see? Your iron will weighs you down, dragging you ever further from your purpose. And what is my purpose? Mythos. Who are we? What are the dominants? The breath of the creator still warm on our lips. We carry his light that we might guide the masses in his name. We are but mighty acts of God. We are more than that. You would be nothing without what he has granted you. The power we wield is his. And yet every time we draw upon it, it wears away at our very being. It breaks us. It unmakes us, that its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The Icon. It is too much for even his chosen few. Apart from you, Muthos, you wield the might of many, yet your body does not answer for its avarice. What are you saying? What I am saying is that we dominance are a means to an end. We were created for you, that you might drink deep of our strength and thereby fulfill your divine purpose. Which is? To feed. As you would know, could you only look beyond the walls of your prison of self-regard. As long as you choose to ignore this, you shall never penetrate my defenses. Still, you may take solace in the fact that you are not alone in your plight. The chains of volition shackle all of mankind, 
but there is yet cause to rejoice. For the Lord, in his mercy, has taken pity on his flawed creations, and shall see them restored to their proper forms. And what exactly would that be? Why, loyal servants to God. Manners, Lord Rossfield. They are men, like you and me. Albeit ones uh, unburdened by the wills that drive our kind to madness. They are pure. They are divine. You mean to turn everyone a Kashyyyk? Not turn, you thought. Turn back. For too long has mankind been led astray by their clamorous wills. It is time they return to a world of quiet equality, where they might once more know salvation. Salvation? And abandon everything we hold dear? We don't need your salvation. We'll save ourselves. And we'll do it on our own terms. Not yours. And not your gods. With every defiant expression of your will, the tighter the chains of consciousness become. But perhaps that fact may be put to use. The it binds you to the remaining dominance, the stronger your hunger will become. Until it leads you back to the only answer there ever was. Mayhap not by the path my master intended, but back all the same. Ash is not far. I could freeze a path. You're in no fit state. Probably not, but I can try. Please be careful, Jim. Bestin, that's crazy. That's crazy. That's ridiculous. I hope the others are safe. The Enterprise was clear of the gap when we fell. They made it, Jill. And they will have seen the ice. Are we naked? We need only wait till dawn. This is the second time Barnabas has bested me. Powerless against him. Then maybe there really is nothing else for it but to. Give yourself to his master. Only you won't do that. The Clive I know would never do that. So you believe? But do you really know me? If what Barnabas said was true, then... I'm more monster than man. Each time I summon the flames from within, I burn away the things that make me who I am. Do you, though? Think of what you've used that power for, of all the people you've saved. It doesn't matter how or by whom it was granted, 
only how you choose to use it. And you've chosen to use it for good, haven't you? I've also used it to kill. What if that's my purpose? What if it's all I'm good for? You're still that same boy I grew up with. Always so eager to save everyone around you. And yet always so alone. Because you failed to realize the one thing that needed saving most of all. You, Clive. You. You never once took the time to save yourself. Myself. I think I might be beyond saving. No one is beyond saving. Provided they want to be saved. You fight to survive. And you survive so that you may protect those you love. It's what you do. What you've always done. And I know you're not about to change. So I'm going to help you. To give you what you need to protect us all. give you the strength to bear it alone. But I'm not alone. These burdens I carry, my sins, my pain, my sorrow, I see now that they are all a part of me. I one day look upon the moon again, together. And I promise you, Clive, that I will be there, 
No matter what you must become. I know. I never thought a smile could bring me so much joy. Sitting naked like that on rocks cannot be comfortable. They can't. <laughs> What of Barnabas? Do we pursue him? Fuck no, we gotta get stronger first. Hell no. No. Our paths will cross again soon enough. Whether we like it or not. <coughs> Besides, there is something we must do first. Of course. Drake's spine. The last mother crystal. Mm -hmm. The Einherja is at the bottom of the sea. Walud won't dare move on storm without her. But they know we're coming now. We'll need a plan. And a damn good one of that. Then let's go home and find one. Damn, this was a long video, but I'm about to end it off, bro. Thank you for tuning in. It's got a lot of shit to cut out, man. But, you know, nah, somebody gotta do it. It's gonna be me. So, you know, thank you all for watching. I'll be seeing you with the next one. Peace.